And now talking about the new year, 2020, of course, it's in the books, and we now have a better sense of what travel numbers looked like last year. And in Bangor, the international airport there reports that numbers there, the flying uh, number of people flying last year was down 60% compared to normal. Bangor International Airport Director Tony Caruso says the low numbers are pretty close to what the rest of the industry around the country experienced during the pandemic. Caruso says the pandemic has made things challenging for the staff and some employees have had their hours changed because of the reduced flights, but for the most part, they've been able to keep everyone employed. He says that it's also thanks to some federal stimulus money that's helped them out. Through the uh, the CARES Act, uh, Bangor received just over uh, $4 million, um, which is certainly welcomed, and we thank the, the congressional delegation for their support. Um, we use that money for operational and maintenance expenses. Caruso says... For anyone who needs to travel, they should know that Bangor International Airport is open, clean, and safe to fly from.